Hey guys, if you hit a situation where you're trying to scrape new information with some of the packages and for whatever reason you seem to keep getting the old information, well, a very simple way to deal with that uh, is to clear your cookies and clear your IP address. What you're basically doing is telling a website you visited that you're someone else because the only two ways it would tend to remember you is either by your IP address or the cookies in your browser or both. The way to deal with that is just open up, close all your browser windows and then open one. And while you have one open, hit tools, internet options, and you know, depending on your browser version, you might have a different set of buttons at this point, but usually you're gonna find something very obvious. Delete temporary files, history, cookies, save passwords, somewhere it's gonna say something like that. Hit delete, and then delete your cookies. Sure, go ahead and delete them. And if you want, delete your temporary internet files, and that frees up memory in your browser. You know, whenever you go watching a bunch of videos and visiting a bunch of sites, then you wind up with all this downloaded stuff in your browser. Now, that's nice because if you go back to watch the same video, um, then it's there inside your browser. But the drawback is that your browser only has so much room to hold information, so it's good to delete the files once in a while. So you can do that while you're here. And then just go ahead and close it and then close that. Now we've dealt with the IP address and we've cleared our browser memory. The only other, or I'm sorry, we've dealt with the cookies and cleared our browser memory. And the only other thing we have to do is refresh the IP address. And that cuts the last way off that a computer can remember who you are. Now you just right click on that and hit repair and it'll refresh your IP address. Now some of you have different icons down here for that. Um, repair is just another word for refresh really. But it's going to be an icon kind of like that. If you don't see an icon at all like that, then just hit start, hit, what is it, control panel? Yeah, control panel. Hit network and internet connection. Somewhere you're going to see a link called that. And then for network connections, just go find network connections. And then for your local area connection, same thing. Right click and hit repair. And that'll just really quickly refresh your IP address. I'm not going to do it right now because I got a connection to an FTP that's just remembering my IP address as a security setting just for particular IP addresses. But it's that simple. Just hit repair. It takes all of about four seconds uh, to refresh your IP address. And then that way, if you've done both things, and the final safety check is just to go ahead and close your browser session again and then start all over. Just open a new one. And if you do that, basically you're telling uh, any website you visit that you're someone else. And then you can continue doing the job. Now the reality check is the packages shouldn't be causing you to get the same information uh, when you run through them again. Uh, but if you are, that's one good way of checking just to make sure there's not a cookie issue going on or an IP address issue or that the website's saying, hey, you've already gotten enough information off our site for one day. <laughs> Any kind of default stuff like that, you can go ahead and just do those things and it should free everything up. All right.